welcome back. We are inside Knit Proof HQ and we're changing these wheels on Millie. Bought something a little bit special that the recent show went to and that's what this video today is all about. So sit back, relax and take a look at these cars that were a Mini Fair 2024 with the British Mini Club. So make the bingo hall, as you can see, car park is full of minis. So we'll kick off with a quick move around the car park, see what gems we've got in there this year. Got some, we've got some lovely machines turned up today. So it's great, first mini show of the year, in the bag. Let's have a look at these beauties. We'll make a stop. R53, Club and State, that's cool, like that. Convertible, good sport. Oh, look at that. Some more modern ones. Oh, nice. 72 Mark III. That's very cool. Look at that. Very cool patina. Oh, yes. Very original. Good in there. Beige, beige brown and two. And it's an 850. Do like the 850s. Very cool indeed. Some more moderns. Right, Morning, you right? Yeah. Some more awesome cars. We've got a Morris Minor, 1970. Morris Traveller, actually. Very cool. Cross 5 GT. Very nice. Love those rust star rims. Look at them. Very cool. And Leyland badge on the A, a, a panel. He's put Millie back on yet. But yeah, some lovely cars. Here's the crew I've travelled in with. There's Millie. Which is car. And I think, I think, I think the purple is one of my favourite colours that they did in Cooper Sport. Very, very cool indeed. Another modern's on the end. Oh, nice. This car's just done the uh, World to Land with No Run. Something I missed out on this year. I need to, I need to get Millie out of storage in time to come and do that one, but very cool nonetheless. Very nice indeed. Paul Smith Mini there just come in. Grab that as it goes. Very cool. British British Green Cooper there, very nice. Lots of mod There's plenty of classics out today. Got classic on the end down here, we'll have a look at this one. Very cool. Very nice interior, yeah. What a lovely car. Lovely T Reg, very nice. Mini lights, they're cool. Lovely. The lovely classic on the pepper pot wheels, they're awesome. Um, you lovely car. Very 
GP works, very nice, carbon artist, very cool. That's cool. I like that. Love the spot lamps. Lovely Mark II. All set up inside. That's cool. Bucket seats, roll cage. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Twin tanks. Very nice indeed. Look inside. Oh yes, all the gauges, hand run brake, roll cage, that's cool. Very cool indeed. Like this is it's like this one's called Billy. A lovely club of the state. Beautiful colour. The basso roof as well. Love that. Very nice. Yeah, that's cool, I like that. S-Reg. I need some of these lamps, I think. Some of these P700 lamps, these are cool. Club number, we flipped them, that's nice. What's in front of there? Still got its, uh, yeah, still got its A-series engine. That's cool, isn't it? Lovely club. Hello! How are you doing? <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> Got him, I'll get him. It's Ted in the back seat. It's hat on, oh yeah! Awesome! Brilliant. See you later. Oh, the edge. Interesting. Let's play. Oh, this, that's cool. Yeah. Very nice indeed. <laughs> Lovely. Cool, fabulous front, yes, yes, very nice, fits really well. And there. Some lovely cars about, there are. I 
some sort of cheeky classic house at the back there. Whoa, we've got a blue oval in the mini section. What are you doing there? thing. There's plastic at the back. Very nice. Is there a cool car? Look at that. Mini Paul Smith, that. Very cool indeed. Very cool for cooking. the sidewalk. Lovely sensitive flooding here. Beautiful, and it's for sale. Mm 
Amazing. There we go. Look at this space. Just me from sand. Amazing. Oh, my mind. Now my mind is blown. No surprise. Guess I should have known. Oh, my mind. Now my mind is blown. No surprise. Guess I should have known. You got control of me. Break my barricades. Walls are crumbling. Grounds, they shake. You came to save. But it's way too late. Every single time you stay, I cave. We're going to have a look around the show and shine a bit now. Let's look at these cars.
I'll have a look down here. Look at all the show and shine cars. There were some beautiful motors that we've seen out today. Now we'll look upstairs at the display cars. Amazing. Lovely. Amazing. Mighty Minis. Check out the roof. Very cool. Love that roof. And the tailgate. We the Mighty Minis. Very cool. Very, very cool cars. Flip front on this one with oh yes, very very cool boost of power mini there. Lots of some modern stuff. Lovely Cooper S. And a Cabriolet. Very cool. This mini is being fixed by normal. Thank you for trying this. Cabriolet, the cabrios, nice, the lovely stuff, Cooper S, nice, OT register, that's lovely, that's nice, and it's for sale, very cool indeed. It's a nice little walk there now guys, so down on the red carpet, all the classics and the moderns that are on the BMC stand, these are the cars are waiting to be judged, the results are coming in in about an hour, so yeah, we're looking forward to this. Has it been a coming? For those of you who are involved in the Kevin Carpenter, for those who are starting in the United States, I understand, that's right, yet to begin with. So, some of you have not so well, but very, very soon, I think the process is well. So, but anyway, Paul, have you all enjoyed it today? That's the main thing. Yeah! So, if you've enjoyed today's show, not many of you then. No, <laughs> Of course they've enjoyed it. They would still be here if they had enjoyed it, wouldn't they? Okay. Before we get on the way, we're John to John, you've got a presentation to go into, is that correct? Yeah. That's all right. Where are you, Sid? A little presentation here for you. Sid Mason. Sid Mason. Sid Mason. Sid Mason. Sid Mason. Sid Mason. Come on, Sid. Sit. 
big ones I ain't got a clue what's going on here. So maybe John, you can explain what this is about. So this joke is for what, did you say, John? The Czech woman told me, but it was like it was a, a, a good follow with the minister of sea. Do you agree with me? Yes, I do. Yeah. Yes, I do. So a little bit of one off there for Sid, and that's the reason for the problem of dedication? Yeah. in a global warming January with no salt on the road whatsoever, it's not driving in the summer. So thank you very much indeed. <laughs> Big round of applause to everybody who's brought their car along to the fair this year. Okay then, so we'll start off then with the Pride Road ship. And we'll start off with the uh, Classic Minis from 1960. And in second place, that goes to Andy Tuck with CBL 852B. Congratulations, Andy. brings us nicely on to uh, first place, the classic 1960s, which is Jamie Garrett and J-E-U-3-1-1. I know that classic is going to try and get a check for it, but they get a check for all the hundred pounds and a France and a nice little goodie bag there as well. So that's a nice little in classic minis from the 1970s. We have second place, with Sam Bushwell with NJU 154P. Congratulations, Sam. Oh, that's Sam. And in first place, that goes to Luke Smith with RTW 702R. And yes, Luke gets the check for £100. It's road three and the goodie bag. And then we'll move on to Minis from the 1980s. And we've got Reese Yule with F235 KDV. All the way from the Reese, all the way from Scotland, I'm just told. That's a good trip, I'm good, sir. Here we go, right. Classic release from the 1980s. First place, Alec Rose with C935 BMT. And the backstory of this is he's had his car for 23 years. Since he was 14 years old. It took him a long time to fully restore it, but I think it's quite worth it. There he goes with the trophy and the goodie back, and then we go to Classic Minis from the 1990s. And in second place, we've got Alan Chambers with G180 YLO. You know what I like about this event? No one's gone home yet. <laughs> And in first place, the classic minis from 1990, we've got Adam, Adam Lancashire, with M, Lancashire, yes, to thank up, to, to, you know who you are, M, 1, 1, C, M, B, there, I think that's the first thing. £100, trophy, and a goodie bag. Right, then we move on to new mini. Oh, we've just seen this face, we'll call you up again, because that goes to Sid Mason, with S, Y, D, 4, 8, 8, M. Well done, Sid, for second place. Always a little bit of And in our new mini in first place, that goes to Martin Cornfall with K90MTC. And he gets the £100 and the goodie bag and the course of trophy. Right, I've got awards here for modded minis. And in second place, yeah? Five five minutes, you've got James McVeigh with B7357 GY. And in first place, that goes to Jason Morris with a WK17 XTW. And I've just been told, how many miles is it? 285,000 miles on this car. 
and he's coming away as he's looking after the world sir. Right, so that puts our right of ownership inside. We can now move on to best club stands. Once again, thanks to all the clubs. Great work supporters have been upstairs, and it's the local clubs that make the bigger club picture, so well done to you all. In third place, it goes to the 04 Cabrio Register. Oh, I think they might be here. Nice rarity bunch. Well done. Right, at second place goes to the Italian job cooperative. And we got some there. there we go. And in first place, the best club stand goes to Mini Girls UK. I think they might be here. <laughs> I guess if you're a mini girls in UK, you have to be a girl and you have to have a mini. But uh, excellent work, well done. Yes. Right, that's my little bit done. Um, I'll be honest, at Winstow's, yeah. Dave asked me, do you want to do the Premier bit? And there's no way I'm presenting that this year because, well, it's, it's just too scary. So I'm going to hand it over to his, his master, and uh, Dave will tell us the winners. Big thanks to Danny tonight again for hosting our show. Big thanks. I don't know. I don't know how many years Danny's been doing this now, but it's been a long, long time. Anyway, it's now time for the premiere. So if anybody's on the carpet that doesn't own a premiere car on this carpet, can you stand back, please? Because we want to see the cars. I've got a little cut to give out first, and uh, because James won it last year, and I must give James a little replica because he won premiere last year. So there's his little replica that he gets to keep forever and a day. Cheers, pal. Cheers. Do you know what? It's a tough old game, judging. Steve Moore, Oliver Bryant was our two judges this year. And it's a tough old class to judge this. is because it's the best of the best from our Hibley show and our Stanford Hill show. Hibley this year, by the way, is on the 12th of May. Stamford on the 15th of September. Booking forms will be on our website very shortly, so hopefully you can come along and support those two great events during the mini 65th anniversary year. Yes, and everybody actually goes away with a medal on the premier concourse today, a little memento to say that they were an entrant. So everybody is a winner, because they're all beautiful cars. Third place, and a check for 100 pounds, and an auto in pack is Bobby Wilson. Okay, in second place in the Premier Concourse. Who do you think it could be? Who do you think it could be? Second place in the Premier Concourse is Dave Ripard and Tim Ripard with a check for the 200 pounds. Well done. And the auto game pack. But also, but also, there's the Premier Cup and a check for £700. Seven hundred pounds. Who do you think is gonna walk away with this? I'm gonna tell you for the third year. On the trot. So James up wins the premiere. Not only does he win the premiere, because he's won it three times on the trot, he gets to keep this trophy forever. Well done, James. Three times on the trot. That is amazing. Absolutely amazing. He's the second person to ever do that in our club's history to win three times on the truck in the premiere. Get the photos, enjoy the moment. Give him a big round of applause, guys. Incredible car, incredible achievement. The only trouble is though now, we've got to go spend a lot of money on a brand new trophy, or cup for next year. Who's going to put the, the first name to go on our brand new silver cup? You've got to come to Italy, take part in concourse. You've got to come to Stanford this year, take part in concourse to have your chance. Also, before you all leave, can you give a massive round of applause 
to our BMC team that have given up a tremendous amount of their time over this weekend. They're out there in the cold, out on the sword, like many of them out there in the, not, not the cold, because it's still warm in it. They're out there in the, the moral weather, and they're going to help everybody out as fast as they can, so bear with us on that. But please give them a massive round of applause, because without them, we couldn't do this show. Because, uh, I am sure there's a lot of people out there that think, that think we just turn up and it's all done for us. It's all, it isn't. We have to go out here on Friday and mark everything out on the floor. And, but we love it all the same. We love it all the same. A big thank you to my other wife, Nikki. Super admin that runs the British Mini Club. Give her a round of applause. I don't mention Nikki very often, but I will today. Because, yeah, she, she's a lovely. I've got to say that. Brownie points to myself. And most of all, I'm going to give you all a round of applause now for your supporting, coming on and making this another successful mini fair. And we hope that British Mini Club and our events continues for years and years to come. Thank you all. Alright, let's say with that, I think that's all from me for this one. Hope you enjoyed it. So next time you'll see me, you'll see me in Nick Proof HQ putting on the tree that I bought Millie today. intentions to make it look like anything. I just wanted these just because I like them. So we've gone for a set of Cooper S versions with 16mm offset. Hopefully I'm not going to stick out too much because I don't like fitting arches. So we will put these on, see what they look like, see how cheeky we are. I think we're going to be a little bit cheeky but I think we can get away with it. Hopefully. Well, I'll do it for now. Yeah. They just look a little bit caught, and the fitment is exactly how I wanted it. Literally, just a little bit of cheek of the sidewall. It's absolutely perfect how I want them to look. Just come out the side. A little bit cheeky. That is still that's still in board of the arch. From where I'm standing, from where I'm sort of kneeling, that's okay. Wow, that looks so good. Those wheels will make a huge difference when we're out on the road with Millie. I want to say a huge thank you to the British Mini Club for putting on another awesome mini fair. We have the great, we have the greatest time, and I'm really looking forward to coming to the rest of the year's events. But that's all from me. Millie's got her new boots on, and we will see you next time. Mm -hmm.